Dubay and Davison, Wakamatsu, Fekto, Kirkland and Radford. One, two, three. And now Annabelle Langlois and Cody Hay just missed the world team last year. Third after the short program, and now based on what happened to Dubay and Davison with their errors in that free skate, there is a shot here for this team. is from the soundtrack The Notebook. Opening with double axles. Side-by-side -side triples. That time it was Cody. Well, they got a jazzy piece of music here to get him relaxed and back into the program. Oh, 
A performance they can be proud of. One of their best skates ever. Annabelle Langlois and Cody Hay. Problems on the side-by-sides, but we'll see where they sit when we come back. Defending Canadian champions on ice next. This team would need 118.59 to lead. Highly unlikely they would get that. Dubay and Davison will likely be our leaders here. The question is, can Langlois and Hay get ahead of Wakamatsu and Fekto? If they do, they get a spot to the World Championships. It's going to be very tight. However, Wakamatsu and Fekto were clean, except for the hand down on the throw. This was an incredible throw, triple sal cow. Look at the height and the poise and speed on the landing. Wonderful opening to this program. You talked about the lifts, Rod. Annabelle gets up effortlessly and has a beautiful position in the air. Cody goes into a spread eagle as they hold the star and flip for the dismount. Very composed and polished performance. Not quite the energy of Wakamatsu and Fekto. Throw triple lots, another a very, very solid throw. They had a season derailed, not by injury, but because of an airline losing their skates on the way to Russia. They couldn't compete there. Annabelle's size three and a half, $2,700 pair of skates lost, lost. And I guess there are no free skates. And uh, they lost uh, some competition time there, and so they had to get ready for the Nationals, also facing some adversity. Let's watch the scores now. Again, to beat Wakamatsu and Fekto, they need 102.61 or better. And they are going to get it. So 107.63, and Langlois and Hay, guess what, are second right now. And Annabelle and Cody, you can call your travel agent. They don't know gone. yet. They're, they're, they don't, <laughs> I don't know if it's sunk in. Yeah, it's sunk in. Yep. Skate Canada still has to make the official determination, but Wakamatsu and Fekto watching, they are currently in third. So the top three teams go.